I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today and it's going to be two separate trips but the one trip that I went to earlier this week I only picked up like four things. So I'm going to start with that bag. The first thing that I got was this bouquet of sunflowers. I think they're gorgeous. I'm obsessed with sunflowers and I think I'm actually going to go um, once they get the forms back in to make wreaths again like the circle wreaths. I'm going to go grab a bunch of different sunflowers because they had these bright yellow ones and they had like orange ones that were like an orange gradient. They were super pretty. Then I also picked up this which is a cute little mason jar and it's like ombre. So it's like clear up here and then ombre into a like sea blue. I thought it was really really pretty and so I grabbed that. The next thing that I picked up were these alphabet cookies. I'm part of like a page on Facebook that is for Dollar Tree hauls and I see everyone rave about these so so much and I would have never picked them up if it wasn't for that page so I grabbed these to try them out and see what all the fuss was about. I also picked up these Granny's Oven Brownie Crisps. These are delicious. This is gonna sound so weird but I actually like to open them up and let them get stale because they're kind of hard like when you first open them up but if you kind of let the air get to them it softens them up a bit weird but that's the way I enjoy these these are so 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 good I picked up a bean and cheese burrito because I might eat this for lunch today my mom told me that I should pick this up and try it it's the Larry the Cable Guy biscuits and sausage gravy I'm a huge biscuits and sausage gravy fanatic and if this is good then I am so thrilled but the only downfall she said it's kind of like two small biscuits so that sucks but I thought that I would give it a try the next thing that I picked up was the VO5 Herbal Escapes Clarifying Shampoo and Clarifying Conditioner. I got it in Kiwi Lime Squeeze and these are for Bobby. He was running out of shampoo and conditioner and those are like my favorite scents that they carry. Then I finally found these. I found two of them. So it's a clam. Adorable. The inside is like a baby blue and then the out is like a matte white and a little tea light sits in it and I thought that eventually maybe I'll do some kind of like beachy theme somewhere and need these. It's too cute to pass up. Also I saw something almost identical to these at Michael's and they were like $4.99 each. And then the other one that I picked up was this one. It's one of those little spiral shells and then the tea light candle sits right in here. I, I don't know. I think these are really cute. I can't remember what the third one looks like. But I already bought a set that I'm giving to somebody, so uh, stay tuned for that. Actually, that video will be up before this one. Um, the next thing that I got is this, and you put a tea light candle behind it, and then it lights it up, and it reads, Always my mother, forever my friend, and I liked that it was purple. I liked the script that it's in. I thought it was cute. So I'm going to send this to my mom for Mother's Day along with some other things. And if you haven't checked out my Mother's Day video, it should be up by now. So go check that out. And then I got a 40 count of tissue paper, just the white kind, because I'm going to need it to wrap things. I also picked up a thing of AA batteries. These are the low drain ones. These aren't good in anything but those lights that they sell at the Dollar Tree, those battery powered string of lights. They have like the butterfly, the dragonfly, the flowers, and the leaves. And I like to use them for those. They kind of go quickly, so I always pick one up, or I always try to remember to pick one up when I go to the Dollar Tree because I have those lights on my mantle. I don't have them on right now. And then I also have them around my crystal um, setup over there. I picked up a Coke, which they got smaller, like a lot smaller picked up a thing of spaghetti because I couldn't remember if we have spaghetti noodles here and I'm making spaghetti tonight for dinner. I know Bobby's very picky when it comes to like noodles. If you use like penne noodles with spaghetti sauce, he's like, this isn't right. So I picked this up just for backup and you can never, I don't know, it's always good to have them on hand. Another staple that I always pick up, storage food containers because I always forget about things in my fridge and then they get moldy and I'm like, ooh, gross, I'm not going to clean that out and use it again, so I end up throwing it away. So I got a pack of two of those. And the last thing that I got, I don't know if this is going to be any good, it was the last one there. Um, I have never heard of Idahoan, I-D-A-H-O-A-N, um, but all you need is boiling water, milk, and butter and it makes jalapeno cheddar homestyle casserole basically it's like an Idaho potato slice 
and it's got the cheddar and then chops of jala chops pieces of jalapeno chopped up in it. So Bobby really loves jalapeno and spicy things and I enjoy spicy things to an extent so I thought that I would pick this up and like make it one night for dinner and try it out. I mean you can't really mess it up too much right? I mean it can't be that gross so I'm gonna try it. That's everything that I got from the Dollar Tree today. I hope you guys enjoyed this little haul and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye guys! <music>